Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas, I'm your host, and I'm here with TNT Dynamite, the explosive one. Jonas, I'm the man on the sticks. Yes, you is. And we're playing Monster Hunter World, Jonas. Mm, it's your world, and there's so. just a bunch of monsters in it. Look at you strutting around that place like you own it. This is the full bloom festival gathering hub. Oh. My ladies are wearing beautiful dresses. Thank you, ladies. Thank Fair. you. And uh there's some some baths you can just kinda like you can chill out here and you can be fully clothed and put your feet in. <laughs> you can put your feet in. <laughs> That's cool. Oh, I could I could toggle the armor. Hold on. Boom. Now I'm just wearing an outfit with a top. I'm just, <laughs> I just took my pants off. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you have on like you have on like bikini briefs. All right, put my pants. Have on in. hot pants. Boy shorts. Yeah, boy shorts <laughs> and a full uniform top. Yeah, but this area does not usually look like this, and I think it's absolutely beautiful. I hear there's a monkey bath over here. Yep, there's a monkey bath, dude. Monkey bath confirmed. Where? What does that mean? There's a bath with monkeys in it, dude. Is, that, is there monkeys in there? Do you not see these? What are these little things? What are those squirrel? Those look like squirrel badgers. Yeah, they look like raccoon squirrels. Yeah, R kind of weird. Squirrel coons. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be a weird combination. <laughs> I like how all the water's like pink and milky, dude. Yeah, dude. I wonder what they're doing in there. I don't know. They're just adding starch or something. They got witch hazel in it. <laughs> Does that work? I don't know. <laughs> All right, let's see if I can find something to load up into. We're can just. You, can you get the big boy quest? I could try. Um, and this is one that you just are gonna die in. I could try. I'm t Jonas wants me to fight Behemoth. I'm 100 percent fine. You know, you told look, me you're gonna. All right, fine. Look, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna load up Behemoth myself, and I'm gonna it's... go in there. Oh, okay. Solo dolo. Yeah, that's cool. And then maybe somebody will join you. Probably not. Uh, probably not, dude. I'll probably well, not Well, you said it. no one has ever joined any quest you've ever started ever, so I don't, as <laughs> don't assume that this would be the first time. It has happened. In all of my playing this game, I've had somebody join a quest that I made maybe three times. Yeah, I think that last one time on the video, you had someone that said they joined, but they never like came to the fight and they left or something. Yeah, that happens. Yeah. All right, so we're just going to eat for whatever. It doesn't even matter. <clears throat> I'm not eating lose. for anything special, but I'm taking these special hands in there. These hands, you see them? You see yeah, that? That, that guy can get your hands. He's going to get the hands, Jonas. So why is this guy so hard? Is he harder than Brocky D? Or? You're going to see. <laughs> You're going to see. See, he's not going to be hard because he came out prior to Bracky D. So, like, the game shifts. They keep bringing out harder monsters. Okay. And then they'll with those harder monsters come uh stronger armor and weapons. Right, right, right. So the level of weapons that I have, because this came out with like the final Final Fantasy uh event that they did. Mm hmm It was like a year oh ago. Oh my god, look. Jonas, since there's somebody joining my game, I can't believe it, dude. Um I have to wait for him to say preparing. Gotcha. Speaking of which, Final Fantasy Seven came out. Why don't you buy a PS4 and buy that and play it? It's not out yet. It's out, out. Yeah, it's, it's out, out. It's out. Yeah, it's out. It came out like a few days ago. No, man, I'm not buying that. If anything, I gotta buy a phone. <laughs> yeah, right. It um, they said it's exclusive to PS4 for a year. So like next year oh. we can do it on Xbox. <laughs> oh wait, so Square Enix is now just like saying, hey, we're on everybody's platform. I well, like they said Final Fantasy VII because I I've said is it PS4 exclusive because I want to play it or at least watch you play it or something and uh it through. and what it said was uh it was exclusive to ps4 for a year then they're gonna let it then they're gonna bring it out to other systems i assume xbox i would, I would play that yeah i'm sure like um i read a review and they said uh it like it kind of it's you know it's not the same as final fantasy 7 but it's similar it's like i don't know if i would like it because i wasn't really a big fan of like 15 how that how you had to like it, the live action fights kind of like this but um yeah. They said it kind of take it kind of combines some stuff between like Final Fantasy 15 and Final Fantasy 7 and I don't know. That's what I need sweet. to do is talk to Ben cuz anything Ben says about it I know will be true. <laughs> That's true. He's done the research. Yeah, he I saw you post on Facebook how the demo lived up to the hype and I was like if any I commented like if anyone speaks pure truth about Final Fantasy it's you, dude. I would believe anything you say about it. Ben is a friend of ours. He has a couple <laughs> YouTube videos out too. Ben's Bloodbath. He does reviews of what does he do? No, he does like 
It's almost like documentary. Type yeah, I don't know. He used to like put together fight scenes on stuff. Oh my god, that guy's small. Nope, he's a big boy, and he doesn't like but the he's, way. But he's played I a look. ton, ton, ton of Final Fantasy MMO fourteen. I think it was that was the MMO. Oh wow, that reminds me of something. What does that guy remind me? He's of? He's from Final Fantasy. This is Bohemus from Final Fantasy, actually. Oh okay, maybe that's what it is. Oh, I'm sorry. Did I just put that on your nug? No. You did. Is he trapped? Did you win now? Did I win? No. He's dead now, right? Nope. Oh, but I got on his biznack. Can you smack his head against the wall? Dude, he's a big boy. Is that guy in there with you? Did I, what happened? Did I just F up? Oh, no, I put him to sleep. Uh, Yeah, he's coming. He's coming. Can you capture him now? <laughs> <laughs> no, Dad. I can't capture him now. <laughs> Yes, and then I just win, dude. I win the battle. Well, that would be very cool. I admit that would be cool, but that would also defeat the purpose of it even being a video game. Man, dude, you you took him out, dude. Look. I mean, I'm hurting him. He's not. Oh, that's no. fourteen hundred damage. No, over here. So he puts like these little wind things under your feet, and the key is that you don't want it to pop up in the middle because they stay for like a long time. So if he puts one under your feet. You kind of want to move so that it's off to the edge. He just throws freaking meteors from the ground. And then he has an ability that can just kill your entire team if you don't know the way it works. Oh, wow. Yeah, he's, he's, he's a big boy. That guy's there. Yeah. I he's shooting him in the butt over and over again with a projectile. <laughs> I see him. I see his uh, his health bar to the I'm left. I'm really of the glad that someone joined you, man. I'm surprised, honestly. Nobody else will. Well, that's what you said. It was just it's just nice that we talk about how rare it is, and then it happens. So oh that's god. Good. Oh god. Come on, dude. I need to move. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Yep. Let's put it over here. All right. Out of the way. Yeah, this guy, uh, I don't know if we'll win, only because like I could see my teammate dying. I'm probably all right. Yeah, this is Behemoth. He's a big boy. Uh, he kind of, they kind of need to come out with more stuff like this. Oh, yeah? Yeah, they, they haven't done a whole lot of monsters that are just like, uh, like collaboration monsters. Like, there's a couple of them. There's, uh, for The Witcher, they have what they call an ancient lesson. You've never played Witcher. No, I've played I very little Witcher, but we do know, I just noticed that the mon they had one of the monsters from The Witcher from, uh, is that under me? No, that's under you. Um, from Final Fantasy, they have this guy, and then they have like Horizon Zero Dawn. They had some stuff, which is a PlayStation game that I know you're not familiar with, but it does exist. Horizon Zero Dawn? Yeah. I've heard of it before. Is what is that game? Which what's that the? Uh... You like play this freaking future tribe tribes woman <laughs> who like hunts monsters? Funny enough. Interesting. He's angry, Jonas. He's a big. He's angry, oh, dude. Yeah, look he's at a, this dude. He's got all. He's, he's a all salt, red. salty boy. Are you gonna, you gonna punch me into this, so I just take more damage now. He's just like standing on your neck. Yep. He is standing on my neck. He tried to hit me with a freaking meteor, dude. Look at this guy. Oh, wow. He's a meteor man, Jonas. Green and Ivory Wayans. Is, is that what he is? He's a meteor man? Wasn't that, wasn't that Meteor Man? Who was in that movie? You don't know. You, don't, you never saw that movie, meteor did you? Meteor Man? Meteor Man, yeah. Was it Blank Man? I read okay. Well, blank Man, I remember too. I was going to bring up Blank Man, but I wanted to see if you remembered Meteor Man. Yeah, first. because it had. um. Didn't he have like a green cape? Yes. Yeah, dude, I do remember that movie. I did see it. I it think. was uh, it was one of those uh, black actors from. Was it Tommy Davidson? No, it wasn't him. But you're close. It, yeah, it was. Uh, yeah, I'll look it up real quick because I have my phone. Uh, I do. I do remember Meteor Man because they got they were really popular and a bunch of those people from that show put out some movies and stuff for a while. I think he was. He was on uh, in Living Color. Did you oh, watch yeah, in Living what's Color? Oh yeah, name? Jefferson Reed, Robert Townsend. Robert Townsend, dude. That's sister, sister. Sister, <laughs> sister. Oh, my God, it is. Holy crap. Yeah, he was, what was he in? Yeah, he was in uh, Sister, Sister. I don't sister. have anything. Yeah, dude. Yeah, that movie was interesting. <laughs> I wouldn't say it was good. It was, 
<laughs> wondering if you had seen it before. Like, uh, I think I, I believe I did. I watched billions of movies. Not billions. I watched like every movie I could when I was a kid, and that was one of those movies. Like, it seems like the age of like original movies like that are just over. Oh, dude, like it's kind of sad. I've been saying that for a long time. Like, cause pretty much the only thing that comes out anymore is Marvel movies, which yeah. are which are good movies. But the reason I don't care for them that much is that they're very predictable. Like you know what's going to happen in them. And then remakes of movies. That's like it. Yeah, that's, that's very like true. all there is now. Not that we'll be seeing a movie anytime right. soon, but but yeah, you're dude, not even like, wrong. Yeah, that's like the only thing that they do anymore. It's been like that for years. Like but I do really like Marvel movies. I worked at Blockbuster at the end of that because like there was a bunch of there was a bunch of like original movies coming out like the whole time I worked at Blockbuster, and shortly after I didn't work at Blockbuster anymore. Like there just wasn't any movies that I wanted to see. Like it's just like they just stopped making original thoughts. I mean. <sighs> There has to be a reason behind that, though. Dude, I it's don't It's not know. a mistake that that happened. I don't know, but it's like, it's just weird. It's is it, just, is it because like, the consumer has become, like, less apt to go see something that could potentially be bad? Because I remember going to the movie and just seeing a bad movie. Being like, oh, yeah, this looks like it might be cool. Yeah. But I mean, and we did just recently. We saw a movie that was an original thought. We saw... What uh, movie was that? Once Upon a Time in uh, Hollywood. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, that there's was, still some out there, but yeah. it's very much... Jonas loved Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. Did I? I don't know. You told me you liked it. I bet that was all right. Like, I didn't walk away going, I don't want to watch that again. You didn't think it was the, a freaking the next coming of Jesus, Jonas? No, no. I'm pretty sure you told me this is Jesus now. I... I I'm we pretty sure out that's and I was what like, we said. Did we just watch Jesus in film form? <laughs> I'm pretty I, sure. I, I speak like that a lot, so I imagine I'm that's pretty sure. That sounds like something that would come out of my mouth. All right, so fine. I don't know how you felt about it. I mean, it was all right. It was all right. That's how I felt about it. It was all right. Will I watch it again? Probably not. No, 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 no. I like won't. Quentin Tarantino, like I really like his movies for the most part, but like. Is, his early movies, I could watch over and over again. Is he too up his own butt? Maybe. I don't know. Is that what you think? I don't know. It's just, but I haven't really liked, uh, I mean, even really since, like, the second Kill Bill on. Like, even the first Kill Bill I thought was pretty good. The second one, I was like, it was all right. And then every movie that he's done since then, I've, just, I've felt like they're all right. Like, they're not, a, they're not bad movies, but they aren't, like, Pulp Fiction or Reservoir Dogs. No, and you know what? And that was that was back in a time where like those original thoughts were definitely more popular. Yeah, it's like you know, like anymore. Inglorious Bastards and Hateful Eight and Django. They were all good movies. They were decent. They're just these, these movies are so effing long, dude. <laughs> and there's like a lot of dialogue that like isn't needed. Like he's very dialogue heavy. Are you saying ain't nobody got time for that? Ain't Jeff? nobody got time for that. Is that what you're and saying? And maybe that's why movies aren't like that anymore because like shows have really taken right, over. Right like, cause there's so much content you can consume out there that like someone's like, you want me to sit down for three hours and watch your movie? I could watch like five episodes of my favorite show in that. Time. Right? You're not even wrong. It's like, it's like everybody's got, the, there's this guy with a machine gun. Yeah, he's being real helpful too, let me tell you. <laughs> <laughs> let me let me tell you. Let me be just the first riding on one. your coattails in here. Let me be the first one to let you know how much this guy's helping. No, I can't even we can't get to the monster. I don't know if you see this wall of wind yeah, force. Yeah, what is that? What's up with it's that? It's freaking a wall of wind, dude. He's been putting those I told you put those wind things under your feet. And if you don't put them in the right place, you end up with a wall of wind, similar to this wall of wind that we have at our employ right now well, how happens I, if you try to go through it it hurts you you just, there's nothing i can do he's trying to do it again you see i, I recognize it then you run over here to this wall and then he puts it right there and now it's you know it's kind of out of the way it's still a little it's taking up some room oh now he's coming hey look who decided to show up for his own fight. Have you changed his form enough that now he wants to be your friend? Uh, no, he will be trying to kill us very soon, though. You have to deal a certain amount of damage. See, there's another one under me, so I'm gonna take it over here. I'm gonna put it in the corner. And you're hoping that your friend realizes that, too. No, nah, he don't know, dude. I didn't know until I looked it up, so. <laughs> it's not like I'm smarter than anybody. I just. <laughs> you just have. 
<laughs> yeah. skills that pay the bills. No, I just had enough impetus to look it up. He's doing it again. Did some research. Yeah, man, you got to do a little bit of research. Uh, see, that was a bad one. That was a badly placed boy. Yeah, he looks like he's not happy. Does he have a final form? Uh, no, this is basically the only form he'll ever have. But he'll be doing his attack very soon here. And I don't think we have a rock, so I think we're going to die here pretty soon. I don't see a rock. What do you need a rock for? You need... Me, Jonas, well, we need Iraq. It's just as much as we need America. Iran. Yeah, and them too. I ran and tripped over Iraq. Meh. You want a rock? Oh rock. my gosh. Oh, we do have a rock. I got to put this over here away from the rock. Oh no, that is right on top of my rock, dude. Where's the boy? What do you have to do with the rock, dude? I'm excited. <laughs> it's freaking nuts, dude. I want you to see it too, but we got to like get some more damage on this man. Him. Oh, you hit him right in the butthole. Yeah. <laughs> Tate smack, boy. The, the, the butthole attack is fucking... <laughs> fucking uh, 400 damage to your gooch. <laughs> <laughs> it's a very... Uh, <laughs> the gooch smack. The gooch smack. You ain't never smacked the gooch before? Nope. Can't say I've done too much gooch smacking I in my life. I call Malarkey Jones. You never did the sack tap ball tap that... That people guys do, you know, which hanging out with your bros in the sack is just grab each other's taints. No, you don't grab. You know, see now you're taking it too far. Wow, I'm the one. I always you never just did like you take the back of your hand and just like slap your your homeboys. Nah, dude, I don't, I don't tend to don't. I tend Personage. to not do things to people that I don't want people to do back to me. Fair. Yeah. Fair. Yeah, I'm like you know, if I do that, it opens up the window for them to do it to me, and I don't want to do that. Oh, yeah, that's very true, Jones. Somebody could definitely see you have balls, and somebody could definitely take it upon themselves to tap your balls. Yeah, exactly, and I'd rather just not touch theirs and them not touch mine. Once again, we ended up with a humongous wall of wind. Oh, you ride him, dude. Ride him like Sea Biscuit. I can't ride him like Sea Biscuit, Jones. He's too big. And he's ornery. I don't know if you see this. But this man is clearly ornery as hell. Yeah, he's not happy, dude. He's got like an aura up on him. His orifice is not quite. Oh, dude, he <laughs> fell. <laughs> he's so muscular. Dude. <laughs> Look at his freaking haunches, man. Yeah, dude. He's like all muscle meat, dude. Yeah, dude. He really is. <laughs> he's like part pit bull. Right? I was going to say, he reminds me of like a pit bull because pit bulls are like uber muscular. So what is this guy with a machine gun doing? He's shooting at him. I don't know if he's hitting him at all, dude. It's hard to tell right now. Does the does the enemy get tougher the more people that are in the fight? I think that there is a little bit of scale up, but I think it like it's Are you trying to put another freaking wind thing underneath me? You mother freaking son of a bee. Um, but I don't know how much it does. Right. Oh, right. we got two rocks now. All right, it's time to get in here. He won't let me get in here, dude. There's too much wind. Uh, the wind does the wind blow you out? It just hurts you. You just did 1,341 damage to his knee joint. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, uh, rock boy. Can There's... you hit it like a baseball bat? No, you cannot hit the rock like a baseball bat. 19. Or oh, that was just 190. Oh, dude. Holy There's God. explanation points. See, that was just 98 damage. Oh, God, please. All right, see, now there's wind all around me, and now I'm going to be knocked around like a rag doll. Yeah, dude. These yep, cool. see? No, I, I knew it was going to happen, and I'm, I did this to myself, and now I'm too far from the rock, too. Uh, I love being close to the rock. You don't want to be too far from the rock. Are you seriously trying to put more wind under my feet? He just wants you to be a windy friend. Dude, he is a jerk. Do you see this? There's wind everywhere. You see, this is the battle, Jonas. This is it's this just is, literally a windstorm now. I, I can't even get over there. Oh, maybe I can. Nope, just knock me around a little bit. Maybe I can get. Maybe I'll get knocked accidentally into where the monster is. Are you? There's more wind. 
Wow, he's. Does that mean you almost beat him? No. Oh. Quite the contrary. All right, I'm super like excited to see this rock thing. <laughs> like, you you can be excited all you want to. If I can't hit him, I can't make him do I it. I don't know how you how you do the rock thing. I don't know if I'm ever going to see it, Jonas. There's wind everywhere. It's gotten out of control. It's like one of those things where, like, we didn't handle the wind early enough, so now there's just, like, too much. There's Does too the wind go away? It takes a very long time for the wind to go away. What is he doing? Oh, he's paralyzed. Oh, Jonas, he's paralyzed. Oh, he can't move, dude. Why are you doing, taking advantage of a handicap? I know, monster. dude. That's not cool. <laughs> He's obviously, he can't control the fact that he was born this way. Yeah, dude. Maybe he's born with it. Maybe it's maybe. Oh, the inside of him looks weird. Oh, he's just powering up, dude. He's probably going to drop some wind on me. It's everywhere. It is everywhere. It is everywhere. And these are only rocks. Hey. All right. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to just... Play. You should explain to me what the rock importance is, because you say these are our only rocks. Like the rock is the only safety, Jonas. Can you not see that I'm treating these rocks like they are God's gift to I, humans? You're just, I don't, it's, leaving them alone and not doing anything to them is treating them like that? I guess yes, so. because they're important, Jonas. That's just not, that's not just a stone, Jonas. Look at it. It's a rock. Oh. It's cool. not just any regular rock, Jonas. It's not just a rock, dude. It's not, Jonas. It's a rock. He has a really uh, whooping on pretty good. No! No! <laughs> get, get to the rock! No, the wind! Oh, that's why the rocks are important. The wind, Jonas. The so, wind. So the rocks are important because you got to get behind him when he does that. Yep. All right, and then my friend left. Uh, so on the on the next episode. All right, that's all the time we have for today's episode. Please make sure to like and subscribe. Uh, once you do that, go back watch every video. Call up a friend, tell him to watch every video, and if you've done all of that, we'll mention you in a video. For Jonas. TNT. <laughs> Dynamite. We'll catch you on the next one. We. Alright. Uh, Ota.